Hello, it's Keith. I am back on Athens. Woohoo! I've been playing here um, pretty consistently right, uh, lately, and I just kind of wanted to show what's going on um, because Athens is a really, really cool place. And uh, I'm not talking about Italy or Georgia. I am talking about Athens MC, the server that is so nice to let me play on their stuff. And I haven't been recording videos because I just haven't had time uh, to set everything up to have people not home to record. Um, and my daughter missed the school bus because of me this morning. I forgot to set the alarm and I magically had today off from work which is oh my god awesome so I'm gonna do, be doing lots of work on Athens today and did I just make the rain go away yes I did excellent let me just show you around uh, you've seen the house before so that's no biggie um, I made a path woohoo a path um, which is freaking awesome. Yeah, look at that. Um, actually, I just extended a path that somebody made. Spawn Town was redone. Um, there's our little villagers. Somebody made these awesome um, farms to collect stuff with. They got rid of... Whoops. There was a pond over here with a fishing dock and some reeds and pumpkins and stuff over here. It was covered down. I imagine there's going to be a building here. At some point, I'm going to extend this path over here, but it looks like they might be adding another section to this forum, so I don't want to put the path through here and find out they want to extend it longer, so that's on hold. And Spawn Town has also gotten a makeover, thanks to Serenity. Uh, she's on right now. I think she's AFKing Serenity024. Thank her. She redid Spawn Town Center. It looks pretty awesome. Somebody made, you know, everybody knows what this is. I haven't seen the fruits of it yet, and it looks like it's doing pretty good. So, I guess we have unlimited iron on the server. I had a skeleton spawner, and the entrance to it was probably like right here. But Serenity moved it down into, we have a a uh, underwater dungeon that's where serenity's getting these blocks from we're gonna make a grinder out of it yeah there's my old skeleton thing we don't need to go down there they also made this message board serenity she's freaking awesome from the uh steakhouse saplings you know uh, lots of saplings in there i stole some thank you king <laughs> My cats are fighting again. Um, I missed it because I was all uber tired. But they went into the uh, end and fought the dragon. Killed some withers. Got some beacons going. So I'm very psyched about that. So enough about... Um, whoa. Spawn. I am going to... Is this horses? I have to get a horse. You'll see why in a minute. Please. Hi, I'm Epic's horse and I want to go home. Okay. Excellent. And obviously there's buildings off in the distance that I don't really know too much about. That one's pretty cool looking. There's some over there. Before, there, I think in the last video I made on here, I was showing the progression of this path to my home area and um, instead of using that path serenity uber bitch she is I'm being nice <laughs> I actually don't know much about her but uh, she's done a ton for the server so congrats to you uh, she made this awesome net uh, nether hub 
I think this is too obviously where the sheep uh, guardian farm is going to be. We have places to go. Uh, we have a hole in the roof, roof, <laughs> the roof that I might build a diamond, diamond, uh, gold farm up there if I can get the resources. And I have the time. I might actually want to try and do that today. I don't know though. Uh, okay. Hello. Um. So I made this is my tunnel to my farm. Um. Oh. Yeah, because Serenity made this, I gave her four blocks of diamonds. I don't know if she's found them yet. I hid them at a village place that she was supposedly working for, working at. But I had the farm, and I had that huge path, but now I can just go down this, which is basically obsidian, uh, and there's site and diorite. Is that right? Yeah. And, um... <laughs> And okay, bye. Now we're alone. I think we're alone now. Um. So yeah, it took a little while to mine the obsidian, but once I got this, which is okay, I also got the silk touch efficiency, and I got the sufficiency four. I gotta make this efficiency four. Thanks to Mega Cherops, I will. Um, so I made this path to where my farm would be. And one direction it goes away from you, and the other direction it goes away from you. Wait a second. This is the splitting point. It kind of goes down and out that way. When all of them just kind of go out like that. Um, I thought it was kind of cool. Because it kind of looks like you're... I don't know. I just have never made another tunnel before, and that was my first one. So yay, because usually I don't care. I just make a hole in the in the um, you know my nether tunnels look like this. Other than this is and this is just nether rock, an unfinished tunnel. So this is my farm. I uh, redid my bridge, as you see. Instead of the flat wood going across, it goes up and down. And I made this building. This is going to be my storage for the sugarcane, the mullins, and all that stuff. And it's basically just um, a far, um, a circle. I don't know how big the circle is, but I did it in my creative world. And each place is going to have, uh, you know, the different things that oh, I grow on the farm. And the different things you can grow with it. So I'm just going to keep. Um, keep. Jeez. Words. Don't make a video at 6, 7 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> because words don't happen. Mind is mushy. So you put the dirt block up there. And. You put a mushroom there. You get rid of the dirt block. And then. And then you just hit it like that, and you can grow a mushroom. And then you can hit it with this, or you can get yourself cut. I don't have extra space. I should never start recording with a full inventory. Yes, but I uh, saw moments without, you know, that I can record, so I just did it real quick, jumped on here really without a plan to make a video because it's kind of quiet other than my my cats um so that is what those are you can grow mushrooms in there which is excellent give me i made the brown stained glass so it kind of matches everything else and out here you know whenever you have water in a building you got to make a dock even though i'm never going to use the dock you got to just make it so
so for the, that, I kind of showed you the fields. Initially, I just had the wheat, potatoes, potatoes, carrots are back there, and another wart. I added my um, a row of pumpkins, a row of melons, and a row of um, sugar cane. Let me just kill this thing. I don't like creepers around. They've already blown up my farm a couple of times. And that's a temporary cactus farm. And on the other side of this stuff, I made these pillars that I can get my um, vines from and also my cocoa beans. And I changed out the the dirt blocks with um, glowstone because I wanted a fortune 3 I needed a fortune 3 pick and I asked anybody on the server if they knew how to get one and Mega Cherups has a village thing at his farm and um, I gave him I asked him if he needed anything and he said he needed glowstone, so I gave him four stacks of glowstone so I could use his villager for my fortune three pick, which is fucking awesome. So now we have to the laggy part. Initially, um, I had about 60 sheep in each one of these colors. And um, it was really good, except for... Every time I looked this way, I was getting 8 frames per second. Looked that way, I was getting 50. 8, 50, 8, 50. So I needed to kill them down, and I figured out that if I get them down to 8 in each one, I'm still getting 20 frames per second. Um, which isn't great, but that's good enough for me. And once, um, once I get two stacks of, I mean, two chestfuls of stacks of wool of each color, I will uh, cut this down to like two or four or something, even make it better. These are my killing farms. Um, I haven't really populated this area yet, yet with the stuff. I just finished doing this crap. Um, so this is where I'm going to get my food from now on. And of course, seeing that I extended the farm, I needed a place to put it. And BW, BWO made a video on how to make a barn, and I kind of stole the idea and made a cheap looking farm. Uh, barn, or whatever, farmhouse thing. Um, based on his idea. It's not fully on his idea. But ultimately, I am going to make. A portal in here so I don't have to run through the whole farm one of these sections probably this one is gonna turn into an enchanting room I'm gonna put up glass because some creatures can come in I might just keep that get rid of the pressure plates on that side and put them on my side so I can walk in and out I haven't really measured this if it's big enough for enchantments I think it is so that's what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make this into an enchanting room this, I'm going to find a horse and tame a horse and put a saddle on it and call on my own. And that's what's going to go over there because that's what this was initially going to be, just four horses. And um, ladders go up here. And uh, what I'm going to do is put the chests up here for the different colored wools, for the 16 colored wools. So I have two chests, two chests, two chests, two chests. And I also got a nice lookout for the farm. So that is what's been going on here. Um, I've been doing a, a lot of, not a lot of work for me, not a lot of work for the average Joe or Joe's Joette, <laughs> Joey. Um, I thought this was cool. I never, that's a fence gate inside, yeah, whatever. You know what it is. You're not dumb. And I just haven't moved my chest inside yet. <laughs> this is the killings that I had from all the excess sheep. That's a lot of meat, so I'm all set with mutton for a while. Ugh, I don't even like mutton. So, um, that, well, 
is basically it for my farm but I just want to show you one other thing before I go because it is pretty awesome and on my way out there um, I'll tell you what is um, going on on the server is I've heard some rumors and I saw a video there is a evil troll like person who has decided to come on to the server um, Slimicus I don't know but I think he's gonna be trouble and um, I gotta figure out a way to stop him from causing trouble I don't I don't care if he causes trouble on King because you know King is the owner of the server so is this a, no okay Who's over this way? I don't know who this is. I don't want to go down. It's scary. So Slimicus has come on here and said that he wants to start trouble. So I don't know what type of trouble he's making look out for. This is to our nether wither skeleton farm. I'd go there and kill some stuff, but I have 38 levels, and um, I have no brewing stuff on me whatsoever, so I'm not going out there. Only go out there if you have fire resist. So this is Mega Cherub's place, which is freaking awesome. And I thought Doc M was crazy with villagers, but look at this. This is the farm. Perfect farmer. Look at that. And that's how you get your um, emeralds. This guy is perfect paper guy. Raw pork, raw chicken. I wish they'd buy raw mutton. I have a shitload of mutton. Look at that. 30. No. He's been doing really, really awesome here. So now we got the people with the books. I'm breaking efficiency five, lore, luck of the sea, fire aspect, fortune three. This is my guy. Mwah! No, no homo there. Silk touch, and you know the encapsulated all. He's got this in the center. Freaking awesome. Main of Arthro, which, you know, obviously Mega Cherups is just getting the best for each one just because you never know when Bane Arthro wants to be done. Power 5, Infinity 1. I should get the Infinity Flame 1. I should get that too. So it's like a grocery store of villagers. It's the best setup of villagers I have ever seen. So, like, oh my god. Mega Cherups. I am so happy you're on the server. <laughs> it make me want to cry. I'm kind of like afraid to really use. Yeah, awesome stuff. Other people's stuff because I've never played on servers and I don't know what's wanted and what's not. But. That's basically the run around of the server. And all I'm going to say is um, Mega Cherub's place. Awesome. Serenity has done. See? Mount Mega. Mega Cherub's. Um, Serenity has done some amazing things on the server also. Um, and this is basically the update for what's been going on on Athens. And I think um, that's pretty cool. Everything that you would want is happening. And it's just whether or not they're going to reset it at six months or not. Because I'm kind of afraid to spend a whole bunch of time making a gold farm. I should give them my extra nether wart. I want to uh, fill these all up for king also because we're running low on supplies i have yet to use this thing too oh there's 25 in there 
I want to make a um, mob spawner. Maybe that's what I'll do today off camera. Let's make a mob spawner at my farm with the dropping thing. Or maybe there's an ocean near my farm or something. I, I also got to make a um, an ice farm because I'm right next to the extreme hills and there's a lot of cows. I'm right next to extreme hills and um, I can make an ice farm real quick. So there's a lot of things I'm I'm in the process of wanting to do. I'm gonna go back to my farm to end this, and um, I think ultimately one more update on the videos. It's impossible for me to upload a video a day. I just am way too busy. It's impossible for me to upload five videos a week I'm just way too busy um, so what I think I'm gonna do for now is guarantee you one video a week from Athens and I'm working on videos and uh, on my free time of a single player in 1.8 and once I get a whole bunch of those up I think I'm gonna put out for three or four weeks a video a day just to get those out and have some consistency for a little bit but until I catch up and actually um, complete that task um, it's just gonna be Athens videos once a week just to show updates kinda like um, Doc M's world tour where he'd just play on on his uh, on his own and he'd show his up uh, progress of stuff he did. Not really recording himself doing this stuff, but kind of like uh, a video showing what he has done. And that's kind of what this is. And I think I might do that once a week. Well, I don't know which day yet, because I don't know which days I'm going to record. And the reason I'm able to record today is that we missed the school bus this morning. This pen is the only MP pen I have. And I want to put what's red that's not red sheep. Mushrooms. But the map doesn't look like we have a mushroom world. Because I usually collect mushrooms and, um, oh gosh, the Cybin dirt. You know, the mushroom dirt. So, um, I would like to put the mushrooms there. And I'm going to make a big cactus farm in this corner over here. To, and move it away from there because um you know cactus is good to have so that is gonna be it for today and i will see you probably in a week and hopefully by then i will have some sort of mob spawner to get drops like um powder and hopefully glowstone and stuff from witches and put some you know make it a drop thing um Got to do it, would prefer to do it in the ocean, but I could just do it really high up there. And make a teleporter to it, I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do yet. But, you will see it next time on the Athens MC Server World Tour. No, uh, I can't call it a world tour. I'll just call this a tour. Of the Athens server. And if you are on Athens and you are making something and you want me to show it to people, let me know and I will show it in my next video. Okay? Um, have a great day. This is Kay. Yes. Mmm.